the announcement on Tuesday was like a bomb. Um, I don't even know what to tell teachers anymore. The return to full-time in-person learning for Quebec high school students starts Monday, even in red zones, leaving many parents, students and teachers saying this could dramatically affect the rest of the school year. The data does not justify the measure, the, the relaxed measure to bring back kids in high school uh, full-time on site. The, the data demonstrates an increased number of cases, an increased number of variants across the board, high transmission of those cases. So you would expect more measures or at least maintaining the existing ones. Secondary three, four and five students have been alternating in person and online learning to stop the spread of COVID-19 in schools. The province reporting 885 classrooms closed, 23 schools completely shut down due to COVID. With variants on the rise in the province, the return to classes is worrying students who are feeling the burden of potentially bringing home the virus. Some people don't follow COVID guidelines some people are seeing other people so now I'm still it's we're widening the bubble but it's it's people who have like high risk parents or people who are high risk that are still going to school in school I think it can do more harm than good the founder of COVID Ecole Quebec.org providing daily COVID-19 updates in schools says his daughter's class is now isolating after reporting one positive case and as a parent uh, one of my daughters in high school in secondary two uh, is facing, uh, like everybody in Quebec, is facing uh, a case of COVID in her class. So the entire class was isolated for 14 days starting uh, yesterday, and we're going to have to get her tested uh, in the next few days. We have 10 weeks left of school, and we have teachers that have been teaching 50% groups since the fall. Why are we changing things now? On top of the fact that teachers have not been vaccinated. If we just continue how we are, I feel like we can ride this out, but it's just, we're so close. Why, why are we undoing everything we've worked so hard to accomplish and get where we are? In Montreal, Melina Jubilaro, City News.